Hello everyone, it's your host, Get Good Fox. Are you ready? We're going to be moving into the final base. Yes, it is time for some more State of Decay 2, the Lethal Zone beta. And indeed, we've got the final... I, I do want to squish this guy. We've got the final base in Cascade Hills. We're going to be heading on over to the Container Fort. Been looking forward to it, you know... Um, Part of it because, you know, I'm ready for the next map. Now, we're going to go in the order that they came out. So we'll do Trucker County next, and then we'll do Providence Ridge, and then finally... What did we break? Ammo. Uh, whatever. It doesn't matter. And then um, we will finish off the world tour by going to Trumbull Valley. And then after that, who knows? Like, I, I've got stuff. I, I got a lot, but we'll, we got to keep playing until State of Decay 3 comes out. So, I don't know. Like, I have a feeling State of Decay 3 won't be out for a good three years or so. So, I got to think of, like, how to have, you know, I don't know, another 1,000 episodes? Let me dead go. You know, as long as you guys want to watch State of Decay, then I am happy to supply the demand. Good sirs and madams. But... Yep, we're going to be going over there. We're going to buy the base, build it up. I'll give you my review, and then we will lock out this playthrough and move on to Drucker. But, you know, one thing at a time, right? Our first objective will be to move into the base. Fortunately, we already secured it earlier, but I'll see you there. And here we are arriving in town. Container fort, you know, may, not a lot to look at, but at the same time, it's a fairly unique base simply due to the fact that it's, you know, very blocky. I kind of like it. You know, I, I don't like, I don't dislike the appearance of the container fort. But let's get in there. What's my? Uh, I'm a striking expert, and good. I do have a striking weapon. Sometimes I'm worried about that. So here's one of the entrances. Uh, this base has two entrances, which is kind of interesting. One in the front, one in the back. Uh, naturally, we have to scout all of the areas, though. No, that's not going to happen. Let's go over here. Um, oh, I see. It must be right here. Okay. There's the other door. That would be the back entrance. And right under here. No more oh, no zombies. We're good to go. What do you know? So here it is. The Container Fort. Potential home site. Someone had the foresight to build a fortress out of shipping containers while the heavy machinery was still working. It's not the most comfortable place to live, but the walls are high and strong. We need 3,500 influence to move in, which we're good on, and we need the eight people also good on. So let's go ahead and move into the final base. This is the largest, most expensive base of Cascade Hills. Okay, first let's take a look at what we're dealing with. So, unlike some of the Sorry, other areas, the container fort is largely empty. Um, this workshop appears to be a normal everyday workshop. I, you do see that it has plus eight beds, but the thing is, the eight beds will be given to whatever facility is there. So I'm gonna go ahead and just scrap it, let me see. That did not count as a facility for materials, we're still at 255. But um, we actually can just use this now. So we can do building prep. And that is because Leeds Concrete has all the effects of a, you know, one of those crazy staging areas without even needing to build one. So let's get started. Our current leader is a sheriff. Okay. Um, what do I want to build indoors? I don't know. I'll build the, the... I feel like the infirmary should be indoors. Let's do... This will be where the training area is. I, I'm just doing it because, I don't know, it just feels like you should have the training areas next to each other. No, no other reason. Literally no other reason. Um, let's put this here. And that uses up all of our manpower for now. So in the meantime, it's time to go do some chores. So we got a wandering trader that is selling parts. The Rum Runners, 
Well, I think what we're going to do is... I just need to run some errands. We're going to squish a feral, and then we'll go help out the rum runners while our base begins to build up. So, the container fort is uh, honestly a fan favorite, to be honest. And, uh, you know... I, I will definitely tell everyone what I think. I'm not going to allow, the, you know, like, the fact that people really like the base. Well, it, it's like, we may talk about why that is, but, you know, I'm not going to, you know, allow that to adjust my review. I'm going to tell you what I actually think about the base overall. But, you know, we're going to wait for everything to get maxed out first. One thing at a time. I'm sorry, I can't. Uh, what else do I want? Hmm. We got six small facilities, and um, the indoor facility would typically have been a Red Talon Officer's Quarters, but I don't have that. Would have been nice to have it, but, you know, can't always have what you want, I guess. Um, I'm trying to think. Like, we got the infirmary in the workshop. This place seems clear for now, but I know that won't last. Where are they? Oh, they're on the other side of this mountain range. That's a problem. I didn't realize they were, I, I thought they were closer by than I thought, but this area does have a few impassable areas. It's not nearly as bad as uh, Drucker County, though, or Providence Ridge. Providence Ridge has that absolutely humongous mountain that dominates the middle of the map, and there's just no way around it. I don't think there's any short... You know, at least in Drucker County, I'm told that there are some very nifty shortcuts that you can learn, but with... Um, Providence Ridge. I don't think there are any shortcuts through the mountain. You have to go around it. So the rum runners, ingredients for the mash. This is the uh, the beer brewing guys. Not a lot to say about them. Other than that, you know, they do pay out pretty nicely. If we do every single quest objective, we'll earn an okay amount. While they're dealing with that, let's see what we got over here. Okay, so everything built. Let's go ahead and build... Oh, we have a Red Talon workshop. What am I doing? Wait, you can build both workshops now? That's interesting. I found some good stuff this round. That's different. You could not do that originally. Why does that matter? Can I build another one? No. Wait, 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 wait. Hold up now. So you're telling me, as long as I build a workshop first, I can also build a red talon? Yeah, no existing red talon. Can I build multiple red talons? No. Okay. That is, a, that is rather curious. Curious because uh, I'm going to do it. Let's do it. Why is it curious, you might wonder? It is curious because we might be able to do more salvage furnace combo with that and honestly the other thing i was gonna do was just build a latrine and no i would rather do that we're gonna have this is gonna be a weird base but you know who cares not me we're gonna do it anyways because a one more salvage furnace could be pretty good sure thing. okay uh, that's got to be like unless i completely overlooked that that has to be a a beta feature because I could have swore that they were incompatible in both directions. Won't stop me from trying, though. Uh, oh, oh no, no. That infestation was just generated for this quest. That's perfectly fine. Yeah, we have a workshop and a red talent. That's so crazy. I mean, like, you might think the redundancy is stupid, and to be frank, it kind of is. But, the advantage to the redundancy, like I said, is more salvage furnaces. Uh, let me see, how many do we do? How many do we have? Can I install one in each? Oh, we have none. Okay, well, um, so much for that idea, I guess. What? Let, let's start installing our mods, by the way. Okay, so it looks like this fire safe storage is already... Oh, I can switch that. That's good to know. That's good. Oh, that's, that's convenient that we're able to swap them back and forth. Let's install the comfy chair here. So I guess the container fort starts out with a maxed out third 
level three storage room, and then you're able to switch the sto- Oh, 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 oh. Not gonna get me. Not gonna happen. Okay, so our new objective is to... Get over here and complete this. Lounge is available, very nice. Let's just burn this fool. I swear, everything is like smearing together. I'm not gonna lie. I keep thinking like, oh wait, didn't I just do this? No, that was on the Twitch community. Which by the way, I am on Twitch. In case you want to see some live State of Decay 2 gameplay, I am on Twitch. And uh, we just did this quest very recently. And so it's all just blurring together. Oh yes, the still, the great, the Zed killing monster truck. Okay, I think we're clear. Now, since our sheriff is our active leader, we might as well... Oh, we can't do it yet. We'll, we'll upgrade. Well, let's go ahead and upgrade this. Three people? Sure. Let's keep the labor going. Okay, so we're looking for... Oh, we got a talk over here. Or not. Do you want to talk? I think she might be a little bit glitched out. No matter though. Can 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 we fling the zombie off, please? Uh -oh. Wow, I just couldn't fling him off. And I can't talk to this character either. Wow, that is ungood. Which is the opposite of good. Where, where, oh, it's a lying to me. I'm not seeing any more of them. Okay, so this is the ingredient, so it must be the rucksack. Got it? So are you gonna talk to me or are you gonna glitch out? The answer is that you're gonna glitch out. Not good. I cannot complete this. Oh, no. That's a... I cannot complete this quest if you do not talk to me. I don't know why that I thought that might help, but... I, I don't know. Let me just try some random things. Oh, it's stuck. I don't think that's going to help either. I think this quest is just bugged. Wait! Did that did that do something? Oh my god, I thought I, I thought I had a 200 IQ idea. Oh man, that stinks. The blo oh yeah, the blood mobile. I there, there's just no way to do this. We we can't we're we're just We are just screwed. Uh, all I can do is restart, reload my save file. But if I reload my save file, I'll have to redo the quest anyway, so, hmm. Not good. Uh, let's go ahead and upgrade this. While, you know, while our leader is out, we might as well upgrade the leader-specific things. Oh, yeah. I do. Oh, wait. We do need to upgrade the command center as well. Um, let me just activate that real quick. Oh, the weights. The weights can go there. All right, yeah, we're keeping our labor keeping our labor going. What do you guys want? Maybe if I talk to one of them, it'll may let change it, it'll fix it. I have no idea. Normally what you can do is if you can convince them hey, to get buddy. in a car, it I fixes everything. Good to see you alive, buddy. Come in. Oh, I want that. Do I want the medicine? Nah. Okay. Let's see what you've got. Might as well. Let's see if the fact that I talked to her changes anything. I have a strong feeling it won't. I think we are just boned. Which really sucks, but... Mm, what can you do? Complain about it. Nope. <laughs> oh! Oh! Ah! Okay, whatever. We're gonna do... Um, I guess we'll do the loot dispute. Wait, what's happening over here? 
Okay, we'll switch to our other character. Maybe changing characters, if it doesn't abandon the quest, maybe that will fix it. It's worth a try. I think. Okay, let's throw all this stuff in the back. And equip a kind of basic weapon. There we go. And let's switch to a Chandra. I got this one. Okay, so you, the ingredients for the mash is still there. So much better when you get here. Let's see if that actually allows us to access the quest. If that doesn't work, then pfft, I just don't have any ideas that, that don't involve, like, resetting the quest again. All right, Jessica, you know, you really you really need to give me this quest step. I'm just saying. I got an idea. Oh, why did that? I don't know why that fixed it, but it did. Hey, people, we got a plague set in the mix. Yeah, I know. Wait, do I have close cut? Yeah, I do have close combat. Did the plague zombie get you? Yeah. Okay, that's good. Good news. I I don't I I guess switching characters fixed it. I don't know if it's like a 200 IQ fix, but like the point is that it's fixed. That's the most important thing. And um, I might as well just grab another blood plague cure here since I am gonna cure her. It's a good price. It's gonna be like five hundred dollars for a single cure. That's a good price. Although I might... Oh, no, I got two. Okay, off we go. We got the food with us to complete it. Actually, no, this isn't the final step. So it'll be like 200 for a single plague cure. That's still a really good price. Absolutely will take it. Oh, man. She already got blood plague. We don't need any more. Thank you. Gonna bump into like every obstacle along the way. For a second, like you live at the Spy Royal. I don't remember that. Place is a waste of time. The all-in-one working out system is installed. That was not bad. I do prefer the um, the free weight set, but cure's gonna help. But why not try? Hold on just a little bit longer. This might help. Talk to Kyle. He says, I can't believe this happened. We're going to have to put her down unless you have the cure. Thanks. Yep. Don't worry. I'll be back, all right? Hang in there. Stay alive, Who right? is it? Have you found the blood plague cure? Sure have. I never knew you cared. I kind of wonder what happens if we just waited the timer out. Would they kill her, or would she turn into a blood plague zombie and then they would kill her? Kyle says, "Oh, and let me get the sack of corn." Kyle says, "Thank you so much. This means everything to us. Here, take the sack of corn." You have to promise me that you'll exercise your strength, though, once you're making your own booze. Today, today, we all get clean. Finish the still, but only for medicinal purposes. Bye. Don't get killed. Yeah, yeah, medicinal purposes. Beer is made out of, like, plants, isn't it? You know, it's not, not, even, a, not even a big deal. It's, like, it's very medicinal. Like, it's the most medicinal. Well, you know, after a hard day's of work, like, people, like, drink a beer. That's, that's pretty medicinal. So, like, you know, I think, I think they're just, I think they got the right idea. I think everything's A-OK -okay for them. Uh, you know what? I'm pretty sure we craft brewed some beer. Like, maybe we should grab some and sell it and just kind of see what's up. Okay, looks like to get to them, we just got to follow this main road. I guess one of the big questions is going to be, what is better, brewing beer or making strong painkillers. 
Uh, my my initial thoughts is that well the strong painkillers will still be relevant because what else are you going to spend your excess medicine on? That's the first thing I'd say is one of the things that's nice about strong painkillers is that it lets you use both your excess food and your excess medicine because you turn your excess food into ethanol and then the ethanol is used with medicine to make the, the strong painkillers. Now if you switch to beer, then um, what are you going to do with your shove? Takes like multiple shoves to bring him down. Shove would be funner if it just shoved him down in one hit. Wait, wait. Are people like threatening each other? What is happening here? We had this place staked out, but before we could go, the maniac Greg showed up and grabbed everything, okay? All I did was kill a zombie while scavenging here. These troublemakers ran up and accused me of stealing. Um, let me see. So you're the forward operators. And then you're the ones who made it. Let's take a look. The forward operators are neutral. Who are the ones who made it? Wait, there's two of the forward operators? And they're both friendly? Le the ones who made it, they're friendly. Um, so because none of them are allied... Oh wait, the forward operators... We have three of the forward operators. Oh my god. The forward operator! What is happening? Okay, well, you know, those guys are super suspicious. Stay alive, I'm gonna, you know, we're gonna not take the side of the forward operators, all four of them. Um, sorry these folks got here first, you should move on. Did you really just say that? Did you really just say that? This isn't just It's just goddamn wrong. Okay, let's see which of the forward operators were affected. Not them. Not them. It was was it them? Uh oh. It wasn't them because they they're still at allied. Um. I have no idea. There's too many forward operators. I don't know about you guys, but that seems really suspicious. Hold the fort. Like, I don't know if I like having so many forward operators in one place. The four forward operators, holy crap. Like, why is the game, ge I mean, they, they must have been generated by, um, the trader. Because the, you know, each leader has a, uh, an enclave that appears that tries to help you with the blood plague. I have a feeling that they're all generated by the, um, the trader. That is so weird, though. Hello? Oh, get out of my way. Uh, you are meeting with your friend, okay? Alright. Good to hear. This will get us some more scent block. Man, like, at the rate we're going, we just don't, we don't even need the, uh, the biochem station. We're, we're doing just fine. Why is your friend so far away? Gosh. 500 meters? I'll do it. I'll do it for the scent block. Oh my god, that was a ditch. That could have been disastrous. But fortunately, we had the speed to clear it. Knowing my luck, we would have gotten stuck, so that I'll consider myself rather fortuitous there. And here we are. That was a bumpy road, all right. You in here? Do I have to kill every zombie myself, people? Stab. Um, sure. Oh. That was nothing. Yep, give me the pain right. cure or the scent block. Now we're getting in here before all the zombies arrive. Oh, yes. And once again, I have stayed just to see how many zombies arrive. It's a lot. It is an absolute ton of zombies. Eventually, I did kill them all, though. 
it probably was still worth the one cent block, killing them all too. But they definitely mean business. They're like, oh man, you have no idea how many zombies showed up. I honestly was surprised. I honestly did not expect there to be that many. Okay, so now we're going to be able to grab another... Oh man, we actually cleared all... I thought we were going to... I was so confident we were going to get stuck on that rock. I was like opening my mouth. Go, go, go away. Stab. Home sweet home. Here we are. Safe and sound. Okay, give me the scent block. Nice. Hang in there. Wandering trader. Eh, I don't really care about. Oh, we got an info. Okay, we got to go back. Oh, actually, we got to refuel. Then we'll deal with that infestation. Also, let's take a look at our base. Let's get you upgrading. You are already upgraded. What were we gonna put? Oh, we can't put the trade depot in yet. Um, let's just keep everything upgrading. So we, oh, I was going to refuel. Getting forgetful. So what we were going to try out is to see if we can actually put both. I mean, I don't see why not. I don't see why they would be. Uh, the fact that they're both there means they should be compatible. I just want to put on a, what do you call it? Um, oh, oh, that's what's, who, is that the traders right there? That's the people we were helping. Oh. They look like they might be having some trouble. Let me see what's going on here. Oh, yes. Looks like he might be having a little bit of a problem, and that, that's a rather convenient for me. You know, I, I'm thinking I might want a little bit of that loot. No, no, yes, today. Like, right now, actually. I feel like the payment I got was decent, but I, I don't know if I'd call it good. Come on, take him out. I, I've decided I want a little bit more a bonus payment than what he gave me. Get him. Really? None of the, no zombies heard this? Get him. Wow, there are no other zombies around. I think these guys might take him out though. To be oh wait, wait, wait. Come on, zombies. This is lethal zone. I, it shouldn't matter that I'm in the middle of nowhere. This is lethal zone. There's supposed to be just zombies everywhere. I am helping you. I'm bringing more zombies. That's what you need, right? What you need is more zombies. You're a fan of, like, zombies, aren't you? I'm just making the experience better. Yeah, I'm kind of hoping today, actually. Like, it's taking a little while for you to die. There we go. I think he's a. Ha I, that's the sound of a happy customer to me. This guy is tough. Ha I think he's gone down five times. Oh yes, go back into combat. That's that's what you should do. Get him. This is the end of him. Get him now. Nice. Okay, I don't know why some like weird chunks are getting blown out over there, but. Okay, you know, maybe you shouldn't have given me all of that scent block. I I'm just saying, if you hadn't given me all of that scent block, m maybe you would be fine now. I'm just saying. Scraps of circuitry. Nice. I mean, I'll take it. And then we could scrap that deck destroyer. That's, that's you know, I don't know. Maybe you should have kept the, uh, the scent block. I'm just saying. Maybe you should have kept it. Maybe you wouldn't be dead. 
But you gave all me the slip line. It's the same. No, Mom, I can't, you can't say it's my fault. I didn't do anything. I really, I didn't kill. That's not my fault. I don't know how any of this happened. And here we are, safe and sound at home with our payment, plus a little bit of bonus deck destroyers, scent blocks, you name it, it, it works out. And it, to me, it looks like things are going pretty good. Oh, it looks like he's... Re yeah, we'll deal with them next episode. It's not that big of a deal. Looks like uh, the lounge is on its way, and we are going to probably change leaders next time. But yes, welcome to the container fort. Uh, if you are a container fort enjoyer, just let me know down in the comments section. I will tell everyone what I think. You know, I'm not going to hold any punches back. You know, the um, you know, I'll give it a fair shake though. Like I'm not, I'm not going to be overly hard. I won't be, I won't be hard or soft on it. But like, I do like to know what bases people enjoy, so if you enjoy the container for it, let me know it in the comment section. Anyways, tune in next time for more State of DK2. Like the video, if it was there, take subscribe for future State of DK2 content. Of course, remember that you don't have to be good to get good.